I've got the controls are inverted. Oh god. Oh oh. Oh, oh god. Oh god. This is this is horrible. <laughs> Some assault. <laughs> oh god. Oh. Oh god. Oh god. It's just oh, it's flighty. Hello ladies and gentlemen of the internet, my name is Fafa Panko and all the sea penguin and welcome to Robocraft. Yes, this is a game which I found the other day on Steam. It's a free to play Minecraft meets, I want to say Hawkin, maybe, I forgot what they describe it as, but it's basically a sandbox Minecrafty thing great explanation where you create your own robots like such here and you fight it out in an arena battle which is kind of freaking cool it's a lot of fun I played it I played it for like three hours or something like that one day that day I downloaded it because it's it's quite a lot of fun took me a while to unlock quite a lot of this stuff like I said before it's free to play on Steam and you can just build what you what you like I will go into the concept in a second. See you then. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back and to here to here to here and here um I will demonstrate the basic concept of this whole Robocraft thing and show you how cool it is. So this is uh, you get three garages, I will show you that quickly. So you've got garage one, which is where I have my main thing, which I will be using. Garage 2, Garage 3, and then if you want any new ones, it costs galactic credits or whatever it is to buy it. Now, up here, if you can see, we've got the little star. That's how many tech points I have to spend. Uh, robot points is uh, how much basically money or currency I have. And then galactic uh, credits are, well, yeah. So you can add galactic credits. It is, um, pay, you can pay for galactic credits and that. I, it's not pay to win at all. Sorry, it's not pay to win at all. It's just pay to win faster, if you'd say that. So to start with, tab uh, brings up your inventory. You've got practice mode, battle mode, which you face other people. This is my inventory and all the things I've got. I've got chassis, these are your blocks. You've got movements, all these things. Hardware like guns, specials like these, and cosmetic. I have none. You've got cube depot where you can buy all these things. These are all the things that I've got, and you can use the robot points or whatever, and you can also get the use galactic credits. So this stuff's quite expensive, like hardware, like that is expensive. That would take two or three games, maybe four games if badly, to get that. So there's that, specials, like that, they're useful, and then cosmetic, a oh, lot. Well. So, yeah. Vapor Trail, that's kind of cool. Then we've got the tech tree, and as you can see, it's pretty freaking massive. You've got all the blocks up here, you've got the shields, uh, you've got uh, helium tanks so you can float, you've got armor, you've got wheels, jets, hover blades, you've got radar jammers, you've got a lot of things. Right, enemy radars, you've got all these weapons over here to unlock, and they're all different tiers, and oh, it's it's... They've got a lot here. I'll give them credit. They have got a lot. You've also got friends list there. Right. Now that I've shown you that, I'll show you the basic concept of this. Is left click, place the block. Right click, removes the block. So you can build round a thing like this. And you need really want to learn the shortcut. So Q for your inventory and chassis. So these are free blocks to get, and then all the rest cost you stuff. Which is annoying. I've got armor plates and all that sort of stuff, heavy ones. So you know, it's it's very interesting. If you want it to be a part of it, you have to have it attached to the thing. Hold right click, uh, removes it. If you just hold right click long enough, it will remove things a lot faster, like so. Now I've shown you the basic concept. Let's go into battle. Uh, I'll go to my garage. Go to there, like so. Load in this robot. I don't have a name for him. Oh, I spawned in him. I don't have a name for him or her, whatever, but yeah. Got hover blades and 
guns and it's freaking cool. These are useful. These, when you flip over, you hold, uh, you press F or hold F, and you will do like a burst, and it can put you back to where you were, which is useful. This green stuff is tier two armor. This brown stuff is tier one armor. There's my pilot seat there. It does not have to be visible. So enemy radar, jets, hover blades, uh, tier three guns, some tier two guns, a lot of tier two guns, and no tier one guns. These are also tier two wheels. Took me a while to get that, so without further ado, P goes into practice mode, B brings you into battle mode, I'm in a tier 2 league, oh, I'll show you that, oh, bugger, <laughs> I'll show you that in a minute, uh, at the bottom of my screen, there is a thing that shows you what tier you're in, which is kind of useful. Alright, so countdown's happening, I'm blue team, they're red team, but either way you're always blue team, so let's get going. Right, my hover jets instantly kick in. You use space to hover, shift to go down, and just float around. The whole point is capture the capture the enemy base, I assume it would be. Oh, I'm just going to drop here just so I can drive around. It should be easier if I drive. Basically, the whole point is to capture the enemy base, which is that red blip on the map on the other side. I need to get to there. Oh, God, that was close. <laughs> I need to get there and capture their base, but they need to do the same for ours, so yeah. Oh! <laughs> yeah! 360! <laughs> Hence, this is one reason why I have hover, hover things on. <laughs> uh, fun. Oh god, okay. There's a lot of people here. My ship should be pretty good at this. I say that as I basically get the ship. Wow, that was fast. Like, look at those tier, like, four guns. That's just nuts. Freaking sure. You can let me spectate. It's like, he's got tier twos. The ones over there you can see are, like, tier... Like, tier two? Yeah, like, tier two. But sometimes people have, like, tier four guns, which is nuts. This guy's... God, that's just kind of interesting. No? Yeah. He's got beam guns, and... Uh, it's kind of cool. So let's go back to the mothership. I got absolutely destroyed, which I'm sad about. <laughs> so I got, I did 56 damage, scoured 4, got 342 uh, robot points. How much does it cost to repair? 200. So I made about 200 profit, which is uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Right, back into battle we go. To battle! Oh, whoa! So if you guys are wondering, I have uh, not done a couple of videos in a, in a while uh, because I've had some things happening. I've, I'm now employed. I now work at McDonald's. Not the most glamorous of places, but hey, it's a job. I am I'm earning money, which is great. Yeah, that's that's kind of cool. Also, uh, I know you're probably wondering where Yogg's play is. Yogg's play. Uh, We'll probably continue. This is just a one-off video, and if you guys would like to see more of it, because this is a really fun game. Also, this is good when you're floating; you don't get affected by ice. Although it's basically like its own ice, because it's so hard to control. All right, let's go this way. Oop! Oh! 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 Oh God! Uh. Oh! Not oh, great. Just drop. We'll just drive. Sometimes it's just better to drive. Okay, that's a lot of enemies. No, we're turning around. We're turning around and leaving. Leave! Quick, let's, let's get out of here. <laughs> that's a lot of enemies. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> you can see all those red blips on the map? Yep, they're enemies. I am out of here. Ah, that is not happening. Go this way instead. It might be better. I'm probably going to have to come across them. Float, float. Oh god, there's a lot of tanks. Oh god, oh god, uh, uh, uh. I was quite good at this the other day. Yeah, like, look at those guns. They're like tier 4 guns. It's nuts. How can, I don't see how you can have, like, tier 4 weaponry in, like, tier 2. Uh, uh, the rage, oh, the rage. So again, CPU destroyed, yeah. 
I should probably just not engage, I should probably just go for the uh the enemies thing. Yeah, it'd probably be better. Hmm. I could try and make a uh if I take these away. I'll disassemble some of this and I will uh make a more interesting uh, I'll try to make a flying one, so I'll see you guys in a second. Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am back, and here we have a new hangar, uh, and I will be building uh, a very basic flying robot, just to see how I would do with a basic flying robot. Now, how I start off usually is making a little tower, and then deleting that so you have a nice block so you can go underneath if necessary. Very useful. Now, if I'm going to be making a floating slash flying uh, one, what I need to do is make it basically quite... Even. Actually, what I could try and do is try and make a hover bike. I think that would look really cool. So if I put that there and that there, how well does it... Uh, it's special pilot seat like that. What we do is put that there. That's interesting. It's kind of cool that they have it so that you know that bit is the bigger bit, so it can't go through. That's 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 a nice touch. So if you click P and go into practice, we'll see how this thing flies. <laughs> this could be interesting. Yes, this is exactly how you want it to fly. <laughs> Woo! It's a helicopter, mother trucker. <laughs> Uh, this is amazing. So hard to fly. <laughs> this is incredible. Oh, oh god. Da, 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 hover bike. Oh, there we go. No, no, never mind. This is incredible. <laughs> I'd love to go into battle with this and just oh that would be amazing. It's not very fast, so that that could be a problem. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's just funny. <laughs> oh, that's really funny. Okay, try a scam. Um, if we put that there, that there, that there, and that there, then we'll put a jet. I don't want to put a jet there, I actually want to put it like... Oh, that's cool, I never knew, if you, I just found this out, if you middle mouse on the thing you're looking at, it will put that in your hand. That's useful, that's really cool. It says you don't have to go in your inventory all the time. That's cool. Alright, so if I got uh, that, like so, and then got the thrusters, wherever they are, and... A thruster there and a thruster there. Oh, wrong way. Like that. It's probably going to be terrible to fly, but I think it'd just be funny. All right, now we pee. Let's give it a try. <laughs> See how this goes. This could be funny. Yes. <laughs> yes. Beautiful. Okay. Amazing. <laughs> oh, that's so great. Okay, I had an idea. Just remove all of that. Get this back up again. Okay. Okay. If we do it that way, out, out, out that way a little bit. Oh, missed. Out that way, that way, and that way. I'm going to do the same on this side, like so. That's even right. Yeah, that looks it. Okay. So then we'll pop the... Actually, you know what I'll do? I'll put it one more out this way. Try and make it even, because the whole point of floating using uh, hover disks is to float. You can make planes when you unlock the... Like, these, the rudders and the aerofoils. Once you unlock those, then... Um, you can do like airplanes and stuff, but for the moment I don't have enough points. The whole point is so like if I try to do that, the star means what tier you have to be entered at. So if I want tier one stuff, 
I have to be in League 1. If I want to get Tier 2 stuff, I have to be in League 2, and then it costs that many of those points to get. And that can take a while, depending on how good you are. If the more kills you get, or the more points you get, and that kind of thing. Okay, so, we put a hover disc there maybe, there maybe. So the point is being even, and I don't think this will work, but again, I think it would just be funny to try and get it to work. Alright, and we put that there and that there. Then we get the pilot seat and we pop it there. How does that fly? It probably fly terribly, but still, it could be quite funny. Oh! Wow, this is actually not that bad. He says as he flips over. Dun, 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 dun. I've got the controls are inverted. Oh god. Oh, oh. Oh, oh god. Oh god. This is this is horrible. <laughs> Some assault. <laughs> oh god. Oh. Oh god. Oh god. It's just oh, it's flighty. <laughs> this game. Oh, this game. <laughs> I'll try and get Flow to work, then I'll go into battle, because I think that would just be funny. Okay. Right. Let's see if I, if I buy, go buy some more jets. Thruster tier 2. How much does it cost for tier 2 thrusters? Okay. I'll buy two more of those. Like that. I can buy tier 3 thrusters, but I don't think I need tier 3 thrusters. Or do I buy tier 1 thrusters? Uh, do I have tier 1 thrusters? I should do. Oh no, they're the smallest ones. Tier 2 are the smallest thrusters. Oh, okay. Right, now what I'm going to do, I'm not going to, I'm going to put them um, sideways, I think. Is there any way to, like, put them, like, directly facing there? Or do they have to be mounted to a surface? If that's right then, I'll put it that way. Oh, no, wrong way. That way, and that way. So maybe that'll give me some turn. Maybe. Let's give it a try. This thing is not going to be combat at all. I just think it would be funny to <laughs> to do this. Okay. Oh, God. Whoa! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Dun, 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 dun. It's fast. Don't get me wrong. It's a really fast flyer. But, God, <laughs> it's bloody awful to fly. Okay. I had two more ideas. Most of them are stupid, but it's another idea. Alright. Take rid of, get rid of those. We want the uh, that block back there again. We'll get the no not the thrusters, we'll get these and we'll pop them there, 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 and there. Which is probably what I should have done first time. That should keep me nice and even. Then if I get the thrusters and I put thruster there, thruster there. Thrusted there, maybe? No. What happens if I just put four thrusters on like this? Three thrusters like that. I think that I think that could be interesting. I'm just testing the physics of this game at the moment. Because <laughs> it's a fun game. It's a fun game when you get into it. <laughs> Somersault! <laughs> Summer so 360 motherfuckers! <laughs> Ow, my head! <laughs> oh, it's incredible. This is the most horrible thing to fly. 360! I might be scraping the ground a little bit. <laughs> the ultimate flip trick. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> Alright, what if I just had one thruster like this, and then if I got. Mm, yeah, I think that, hopefully that'll work. If I just did one thruster in the middle so the forces kind of spread out. My knowledge of physics is very. not that great, even though I'm taking it at A level. Alright. That, that flies a lot better. 
still a bit rocky here and there, but it's still pretty good. Again, scraping the ground. Woo! Note to self, hoverboards are the way to get stunts. See how hover blades work is that they will try and keep you a certain distance off the ground, and the higher tier hover blades are better at uh, take you at higher distances and are better at doing that and can lift more weight and that sort of thing. So, you know. So this is this is kind of interesting how this is. Houston, we may have a problem. Woo! <laughs> Front flip, mother trucker! Yes, son. Checking up my ride. Pretty sweet, innit? Front flip! Aww. Let's just crash into this guy. Where are you going? Come back here. I need to crash into you. <laughs> if I can, if I can get control first. Aww. So that's the. Uh, I'll leave it there with the uh, the hover blade thing because that's it's pretty terrible. But yeah, that's kind of the physics of that. Which is kind of funny. All right, we'll go out to the uh, garage.